Proverbs 1.10 says, My son, if sinners entice you, do not give in to them. When it comes to choosing your friends, often they are asking you to join them. If they are engaged in wrongdoing or misbehavior, they will probably try to entice you with all the wonderful benefits of being their friends. They will probably be very attractive. But if they are living in a way that displeases God and brings his punishment, if they are unwise, and if you are drawn to be their friends, you will be punished with them. If, however, you learn God's wisdom, you will always find out what your friends want to do and whether or not it's what God wants you to do. And as a result, you can miss the punishment because you were wise. Someone once said, if you're not in the picture, you can't be framed. What this means is that if you choose to not follow people who are disobeying God, when it comes time for them to be arrested or punished severely, you won't be one of them. You will be with other friends who, instead of being punished, are obeying God and enjoying his rich favor. Would you consider today what your current friends are pursuing as the goals of their life? If they are not godly, would you love them but not make them your best friends? In the future, whenever you start to choose friends, would you do the same? Consider if they love God and if their goals and practices in life are what God wants them to do. And if so, make them your best friends. If not, find others so you're not framed, but enjoy life.